Hey everybody, uh, thought I'd make a video of what it's like for me to go surfing. Uh, bring you to the beach with me today. Sorry, bouncing around here a little bit. Uh, got the uh, whole board right there, ready for takeoff. The old surf, one of the old surf spots down here. Getting ready to walk out. All right, give me a second to down this delicious energy drink that I got and uh, grab the board and we'll be off to the other beach here. Hold on for a second, you're gonna get dark. I gotta pick up a surfboard here. All right, here we go. Oops, forgot to pay the pay meter. I uh, hope I don't get a ticket. All right. I don't know if you can hear the waves or yet or not, but I'm sure you can, but now I think I'm like one of the only people here. A buddy of mine should be showing up here pretty soon, but as far as I know, I'm like one of the very few here so far. Uh, we finally got a beach back. The uh, beach used to, those dunes used to be at the ends of all these walkways that I'm on, these piers, these boardwalks or whatever. As you can see from the Tropical Storm Debbie, it uh, eroded about 20, 30, maybe even 40 feet of beach here. It took out a lot of sea turtles. <laughs> and, uh, well, needless to say, it left us with a lot more sand and not as much beach. Not a good thing, not a good thing. Um, Anyway, uh, I'm gonna check it right here. I think I'm just gonna stop right here. Probably, probably get ready right over here in the shade, man. This looks like a good spot. Oh, cool! These people built their own little steps out here now. They used to not be there. Oh yeah. Okay, this looks like a good spot to set up camp, huh? What do you think, people? Just as good as any, right? All right, now. There's a stand-up paddler out there. I don't know if you can see. I don't know how good this camera is on on zoom. I've never videoed with the iPhone before. I can't zoom. It don't look like. I guess I don't know. Uh, there he is out there. Maybe you can see him. Maybe you can't. I don't know. There's another one over there. I'm pointing at him right now. He's like in the center of the frame. They're about, I don't know, we don't get a lot of waves down here on the, on the uh, Gulf Coast, down here in uh, St. Pete, Tampa Bay area. Um, so these are only about knee high, maybe, maybe thigh, maybe waist at the most. Not really a lot, but uh, you know, you take what you get and uh, I'll take whatever waves that they give me. Um, that's why I bought this long board. Um, I have a shorter board, but uh, it's um, meant for like the East Coast and a little bit bigger waves and stuff so anyway I'm going to uh, take this backpack off and uh, get ready I brought some munchy food with me today and stuff I plan on being here for a couple hours I don't have to work until like three or four so anyway oh there he is now there you can see me cut a wave and rode it all the way in down there he's riding on a the wave they're like knee high mostly mostly about knee high I'd say there's a rock jetty over there you can't really see it because of the uh, steps it's like right under the steps 
Um, the waves are usually good right off the end of it. I like surfing over there, but you gotta watch for the rocks. Um, wish I could wish I could video myself surfing, but um, I'm not gonna leave my phone just sitting here chilling and recording and stuff out in plain view and everything. Um, it's a pretty safe place right here, but uh, um, I just don't want to do that in case um, in case the wind would knock me over something. But anyway, I'm going to uh, strap the leash on, paddle out, see if I can't catch some. All right, peace.